am the founder of Project You Are OK, and I'm afraid of balloons popping. So I've surrounded myself by popping balloons. And my friends are here to help me out. For instance, here is Sarah Heveron Smith. Hi. Hello, Sarah. How are you? I'm really good, nervous, yeah. but I'm hanging in there. I know that you've brought something you're nervous about, too. I do. And I don't know what you've written. Do you want to Should share? I show you? Yeah, let's, let's see it. Bees. Bees! Bees. Bees are the enemies of balloons. Bees are monsters who will destroy anything, including balloons. Is there a specific instance that happened that has led to you having this fear of bees, which has a name that I'm blanking on, and I'm gonna have Charlie edit in right here what the name of it is. <laughs> bee phobia. Bee phobia. Um, I think I got stung a lot as a kid when I was playing soccer, when I was just outside, and I had one big incident when I was like at my babysitter's, stepped on a log that had some bees living in it and then just like ran away but still got stung by bees. That was like the first time I got stung a lot. And then for the next few years, I just felt like I kept getting stung by bees. Are you totally psyched that bees are dying? No, I'm sad. I wish, like I wish they weren't dying. I know they're useful logically, but if they're around me, I'm scared of them. You hope they die when they're near you. Yeah, or just that they like fly somewhere else. How do you feel about people who like their new hobby is just like keeping bees. I had a big crush on a guy who was a beekeeper. Oh, was he beardy? Bee. No, no, he was oh, a redhead. Oh, really? I don't know. Really? Yeah. I thought all beekeepers have huge beards and live and wear plaid and live in the north northwest. I think that would be too scary. Like the bees would hang out in their beards. Wouldn't they love that though? Maybe. <laughs> Build a little honeycomb. <laughs> A little honeyness <laughs> right on in their face. <laughs> anyway, you were in love with a beekeeper. Yeah, so I thought that was like the universe's way of just like making fun of me. What about as an exposure exercise, would you do that thing where they put a queen bee on you and then you get a beard of bees? That sounds horrible. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. A, you have to have a beard. B, it has to be of bees. Uh, oh my God. Like I would rather just be a beekeeper for a day with the full suit and have a beard of bees. Does it make you nervous when you see other people get stung in movies and stuff? Oh, God, what movie does that happen in? I don't know, Bee Sting the movie. Oh my God, that movie yeah. is awful. It doesn't, it Bee Sting 2, <laughs> uh, oh Rise of the Bee Stings, Bee Sting 3D. Uh-huh, that's the worst one. Bees seem like a really rational fear though, because, you know, like you obviously you don't want to get stung. Sure. This is one of those things that like biologically, I am afraid of a thing that will like hurt me yeah. and has no benefit to me. And something that has hurt me. Right, exactly. Yeah. So I think what we're gonna do, Sarah's gonna give you a uh, pin. We're right. gonna have you, so my, you talked to share your fear with me. Uh -huh. You ready to be a bee and sting that balloon? Oh yeah, are you okay? For, nope, do it, this? yeah, let's go. Okay. Ah, okay, go, I'm a bee. <laughs> you are a bee! I'm a bee! <laughs> You're a bee? I lived! <laughs> thank you! Thank you! Thank you! I'm so glad that balloon is gone. Sarah, thank you so much thank for being you here. Thank so much, Jenny. For the people at home, mm -hmm. uh, if they wanna, you know, if they're like, I have a bee phobia too, I wanna talk to somebody about it, where can they find you on the internet? Uh, they can find me on Twitter, at SC Heffron, um, and that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, check us out at projectyouareok.org, and most of all, thank, thank you, you for being a friend. <laughs> Traveling down on bees and on the bees. bees. Your bees are pure, you're a bee and a cop for bee. <laughs> Love me. And if you threw a pot bee, bees. <laughs> <laughs> Is it the tail blade? <laughs>